Did you know that writer Catherine Mansfield, known for her profound insight into human complexity, experienced a passionate love for women while battling tuberculosis? From the passionate and forbidden love of Lorraine Hansberry to the devastating loss of Audre Lorde to cancer. Here are 50 famous women who like women who died of horrible disease. One, Lorraine Hansberry, a bright light in American theater. Lorraine Hansberry broke barriers with her words, but her life was equally complex behind the curtain. The creator of A Raisin in the Sun was not only a pioneer for black voices, but also a black lesbian woman navigating a world harsh to her very existence. Diagnosed with pancreatic cancer at just 34, Hansberry faced immense physical suffering. The cruel illness robbed her of years, but not her passion. Two. Alice B. Sheldon, a name that might be unfamiliar. Alice B. Sheldon captivated the minds of countless readers under the pen name James Tiptree Jr. Known for her explorations of gender and identity, Sheldon dared to blur the lines of what was expected in a male-dominated literary world. Though quiet about her own relationships, her love for women deeply influenced her writing. In the end, a long battle with her own mind left her isolated, depression consuming her like a slow shadow. 3. Urvashi Vaid Dedicated to justice, Urvashi Vaid was more than an activist. She was a force. Fighting for LGBTQ plus rights in a time that needed her voice, she faced the world with fierce courage. She loved openly, shared her life with comedian Kate Clinton, and never let her identity be hidden. But as the years went on, a relentless cancer gripped her body. Despite the treatments and her determination, the disease took her in 2022. 4. Catherine Mansfield The New Zealand writer Catherine Mansfield, who captured human complexity so vividly, knew her share of suffering. She loved passionately, and women like Ida Baker stood by her through the darkest days. Tuberculosis slowly drained her strength, yet she continued writing until her final breath. She died in 1923, leaving stories filled with emotions too deep for words. The disease that weakened her body couldn't quiet her voice. 5. Sally Ride The first American woman in space, Sally Ride, lived a life that many only dream of. Her journey beyond Earth was extraordinary, but her private world was quiet and kept away from the spotlight. Diagnosed with pancreatic cancer, she faced the battle with few by her side, her partner Tam O'Shaughnessy being her closest comfort. She slipped away in 2012, the stars she once soared beyond looking down, a silent reminder of the strength she carried within. Charlotte Cushman, an unstoppable force in 19th century theater, Charlotte Cushman was as bold in her roles as she was in her love. Playing Hamlet and Romeo, she defied expectations, her relationships with women as fearless as her performances. Diagnosed with breast cancer, Cushman's determination never waned. She performed until the very end. She lost her battle in 1876, her curtain call final, but her legacy as a boundary-breaking figure remains. Seven. Sylvia Rivera, a fighter for LGBTQ plus rights, for her community, for herself. Sylvia Rivera found love with Julia Murray, and together they supported one another in a world that rarely gave them space to breathe. Liver cancer slowly weakened Sylvia, but even in her illness, she never stopped fighting for trans rights. She died in 2002, her voice still resonating in the streets she once marched. Eight. Barbara Giddings, the mother of the gay rights movement, Barbara Giddings was a force to be reckoned with. She stood proudly alongside her partner, Kay LaHusson, pushing for change at a time when silence was expected. Cancer tried to silence her, but her spirit fought on, refusing to give in until February of 2007. She left a legacy of resilience and passion that future generations still look up to, like a lighthouse in the fog of history. 9. Patricia Highsmith The mind behind The Price of Salt, Patricia Highsmith wrote stories that challenged societal norms. Her novels, filled with complex LGBTQ characters, broke the mold of her time. 
Aplastic anemia began its slow and deadly grip on her body, but even as her strength waned, her writing continued. The darkness of her illness only added depth to her words. She died in 1995, leaving stories heavy with her inner battles. How much of her darkness seeped into her work? 10. Gloria Anzaldua A voice for queer Chicana women. Gloria Anzaldua embraced her identity through her writing and her deep connection with Cherry Moraga fueled her passion for change. Diabetes took its toll on Gloria, draining her energy, but never her spirit. She passed in 2004, her exploration of identity and belonging left incomplete, but her words still whisper to those who seek to understand their place in the world. 11. Audre Lorde, a warrior, a poet. A voice that couldn't be silenced Audre Lorde faced breast cancer and later liver cancer with unflinching openness, sharing her journey and refusing to hide her pain. Her words in the cancer journals spoke truth to a reality many feared to face. Lorde died in 1992, but her spirit, her words, still rose, a rallying cry against the injustices she fought. 12. Ruth Ellis. Living to be 101, Ruth Ellis left behind a lifetime of advocacy. She shared her life with Babe Franklin, creating safe spaces for LGBTQ plus youth and ensuring others found the security she once lacked. Her later years brought health struggles, including heart disease, but even as her body weakened, her passion didn't. 13. Tallulah Bankhead, a life in the spotlight. Tallulah Bankhead left an unforgettable impression with her voice and audacious style. Her relationships with women were as bold as her career, but years of alcohol and substance use took a toll, leading to her death from pneumonia in 1968. Tallulah left an image of extravagance, yet beneath it was a woman who lived unapologetically, her life a testament to love without boundaries. These women, talented, courageous, and deeply human, lived in a time when their love could not be openly embraced. When their illnesses were a battle, they faced largely alone. They carried not only the weight of their art and activism, but also the struggles of a world unwilling to fully accept them. Their stories are reminders of resilience, of how love can defy time, and of how illness, though cruel, can never diminish the light they brought into this world. What other untold stories are hidden in history waiting to be heard? 14. Ma Rainey Known as the mother of the blues, Ma Rainey transformed music with her deep, soulful voice and raw lyrics. Living fearlessly, she expressed her love for women through her songs, a beacon of courage in a restrictive era. She never backed down, but the road was long and hard, with endless travel and the strain of performances wearing her down. In her later years, heart problems took hold, and on December 22, 1939, Ma Rainey took her final breath, her voice forever echoing in the blues she left behind. 15. Nancy Cardenas One of Mexico's first public figures to openly declare she was a lesbian. Nancy Cardenas was a playwright, poet, and activist who fought fiercely for LGBTQ plus rights. Her work celebrated love and challenged the boundaries of a conservative society. Cancer entered her life like an unwelcome shadow. But even then, she continued to push forward, dedicating her last years to advocacy. Nancy passed away on March 23, 1994, leaving behind more than her words. She left hope for a future where love could be free. 16. Rachel Carson The author of Silent Spring, Rachel Carson changed how the world saw the environment. Her powerful writing warned of the dangers of pesticides, urging people to protect the earth. Carson's private life was touched by a deep love for Dorothy Freeman, whose letters offered warmth and comfort. As she worked on her groundbreaking book, breast cancer took its toll on her health. She fought against the pain, driven by the importance of her mission. Carson passed away in 1964, her body succumbing. 17. Frida Kahlo the iconic Mexican painter Frida Kahlo was known for her surreal, intensely personal art. Her life was filled with physical pain. A tragic bus accident left her suffering for years, along with polio and surgeries. 
Though married to Diego Rivera, her letters reveal her deep affection for women, showing her untamed spirit. Her final years were marked by worsening health. On July 13, 1954, her pain came to an end. 18. Eleanor Roosevelt, a first lady who reshaped her role into one of activism and social change, Eleanor Roosevelt shared a special connection with Lorena Hickok. Their letters revealed an intimacy that gave Eleanor strength to face the challenges of her position. Even as heart disease slowly weakened her, she continued to push for human rights. She never let her illness take away her passion. On November 7, 1962, Eleanor passed on, leaving behind not just a legacy of social justice. 19. Eva Gore Booth An Irish poet and suffragist, Eva Gore Booth's love for fellow activist Esther Roper defined much of her life. Together, they fought for women's and workers' rights, challenging the rules that tried to limit them. Cancer came into Eva's life, but she did not let it quiet her voice. She kept writing kept fighting until her death in 1926. Eva's courage remains an inspiration for those who still fight for equality today. 20. Virginia Woolf A key figure in modern literature, Virginia Woolf explored deep human emotions in her work. Her personal life, however, was marked by her battle with mental illness. She had an intimate relationship with writer Vita Sackville West, whose love inspired Orlando, a story about breaking the boundaries of gender. Despite her struggles, Virginia's creativity flourished, but the weight of her depression grew unbearable. On March 28, 1941, she took her own life, her words lingering as a testament to her genius and her pain. 21. Renee Richards a groundbreaking figure in sports, Renee Richards broke barriers for transgender people. Her tennis career was surrounded by controversy, but she remained true to herself. Renee loved deeply, and her relationships with women were a constant source of strength. In her later years, pancreatic cancer came for her, and in 2023, she lost the battle. 22. Mercedes de Acosta, a Hollywood writer Mercedes de Acosta lived a bold life, defying the norms of her time. She loved openly her romances with stars like Greta Garbo and Marlene Dietrich, making her infamous. Mercedes did not shy away from her truth, documenting her love in her autobiography. In 1968, after a long fight with cancer, she passed away. Gladys Bentley, a powerful performer of the Harlem Renaissance, Gladys Bentley was known for her masculine attire and blues music that challenged gender norms. She sang with passion, her lyrics reflecting her life as an openly lesbian artist. As she grew older, her health declined, with pneumonia ultimately claiming her life in 1960. 24. Sarah Josephine Baker A pioneering public health doctor, Sarah Josephine Baker made huge strides in keeping New York's children and mothers healthy. Her relationships with women were discreet, but her love was real, offering her a sense of companionship. Cancer eventually weakened her, but her dedication to medicine never faltered. In 1945, she passed away. 25. Pierre Anguilly, an Italian actress who dazzled Hollywood with her talent and beauty. Pierre Anguilly's relationships with men were public but whispers suggested she also shared deep connections with women. Her life was one of searching for acceptance, for love, and her struggles with mental health grew too much to bear. At 39, she took her own life in 1971, leaving behind a memory touched by sadness. 26. Margaret Mead A trailblazing anthropologist, Margaret Mead opened the world's eyes to cultural and gender diversity. She had intimate relationships with women like Ruth Benedict and Rhoda Metro, whose love fueled her work. Despite battling pancreatic cancer, Mead continued her studies until her final days. She passed away in 1978, but her influence on anthropology and feminism remained strong. These women, musicians, writers, activists, scientists, lived in a world that often rejected their love and tried to silence their voices. They faced illness that drained their bodies but could not steal their courage. 
they left behind stories of love, struggle, and triumph, proving that even in the darkest times, there is strength. What other whispers of courage are hidden in the pages of history waiting to be heard? 27. Pamela Coleman Smith Known for her captivating illustrations of the Rider Waite tarot deck, Pamela Coleman Smith lived a life filled with mystery and art. She was an artist and a mystic, and her close friendships with women were a vital part of her existence. Details of her personal life remain elusive, yet the bond she shared with her companions added warmth to her creative spirit. As she grew older, her health weakened. Anemia and severe respiratory problems drained her energy, leading to her death in 1951. 28. Juna Barnes A writer who thrived in the bohemian circles of Paris, Juna Barnes gave voice to the complexities of love between women in a time when such stories were rarely told. Her relationships with women were intense and real, but her later years were filled with solitude. Chronic illnesses and struggles with her mental health led her to withdraw from the world she once embraced. In 1982, Juna passed away, leaving behind a body of work that continues to speak to those who seek the raw truth of the human heart. 29. Susan Sontag Not afraid to ask questions others avoided, Susan Sontag was a thinker, a writer, and a force in both literature and activism. She shared a powerful connection with photographer Annie Leibovitz, their love and artistic partnership creating a lasting impact on their work. Sontag's body fought cancer, breast, uterine, and finally leukemia. Her fight was fierce, but in 2004, she could no longer keep the illness at bay. Her words, her ideas still linger, a reminder that even the sharpest minds are not invincible. 30. Marlene Dietrich. A name that conjures glamour, strength, and defiance, Marlene Dietrich was an actress who broke the mold, challenging gender norms and loving freely. Her romances with both men and women were whispered about, but she never let those whispers define her. In her later years, her health began to fail. Multiple spinal injuries from accidents and kidney failure drained her strength. She passed away in 1992, but her allure her fearless embrace of who she was remains a beacon for those unafraid to live authentically. 31. Gertrude Stein A powerful voice in literature, Gertrude Stein was an art collector and a cultural icon. Her Paris home was a meeting place for some of the most brilliant minds of the 20th century. At her side, through it all, was Alice B. Toklas, her partner in both love and creativity. Gertrude faced stomach cancer in her final days, an illness she bore with the unwavering support of Toklas. She died in 1946, but her influence on literature and art has never faded, her love for Alice immortalized in her work. 32. Renée Vivian Known as the Muse of the Violets, Renée Vivian was a poet whose life was filled with longing and beauty. Her love for women, especially her passionate romance with Natalie Clifford Barney, colored her work with themes of desire and sorrow. But Renee's life was marked by struggle, an addiction to opiates and malnutrition weakened her, and in 1909, she passed away. 33. Anne-Marie Schwarzenbach A restless spirit, Anne-Marie Schwarzenbach's life was filled with travels across continents. She was a writer, a photographer, and a woman who loved without constraint, her androgynous style challenging the rules of her time. But within her adventurous spirit was a profound sadness. Addiction and mental health struggles haunted her, and at 34, a bicycle accident led to a slow decline in her health. She died in 1942, her legacy one of exploration and defiance, her photographs and stories capturing a world that seemed just beyond reach. 34. Sarah Orne Jewett A writer whose gentle stories brought the rural New England countryside to life, Sarah Orne Jewett had a bond of deep affection with Annie Fields, bringing comfort and inspiration to her work. But a stroke left Sarah struggling, her body no longer able to keep up with her creative mind. In 1909, she passed away, 
her words a reminder of the beauty found in the simple, the ordinary, and the love shared quietly between two women. 35. Nancy Valverde. Standing up against those who tried to strip her of her identity, Nancy Valverde was a Chicana lesbian who faced constant harassment for wearing men's clothing, becoming a symbol of strength for women who refused to conform. Cancer came into Nancy's life later on, slowing her down, but never breaking her spirit. She spent her last years mentoring young LGBTQ plus people, sharing her story and the lessons she had learned. Nancy passed in 2021, 36, Nina Simone. Her name alone evokes power. Nina Simone was a musician whose voice demanded change, whose songs spoke of freedom and justice. Her relationships were as complex as her music, and her deep connections with women were a source of comfort and strength. In her later years, breast cancer took hold, slowly taking her away from the music she loved. She died in 2003, her song still echoing, a call for equality and love that remains unanswered even today. 37. Radcliffe Hall. Radcliffe Hall, the name that broke through barriers. Hall, known for her groundbreaking novel, The Well of Loneliness, was open about her love for her partner, Una Trubridge. Together, they faced a world that often turned its back on them. Hall embraced an androgynous style, wearing tailored suits, refusing to fit into society's neat boxes. In her later years, she battled colon cancer, a painful struggle made worse by the social rejection she endured. She passed away in 1943, her legacy a brave reminder of living authentically in a world that demanded silence. 38. Gia Karangi. One of the first supermodels, Gia Karangi's face appeared on every major magazine of the 70s and 80s. But behind the beauty and fame was a young woman struggling with her demons. Gia loved women openly in an industry that wanted her to stay silent. Her battle with heroin addiction eventually led her to contract a virus that, at the time, was seen as a death sentence. Gia died in 1986, just 26 years old, her story one of beauty and tragedy. A reminder of how fragile even the brightest stars can be. 39. Del Martin. Sharing her life with Phyllis Lyon, Del Martin was a partner in love and in the fight for LGBTQ rights. Together, they founded the Daughters of Belitis, a group that gave voice to lesbian women when no one else would. Despite facing osteoporosis, which left her in pain and weakened, Del continued her work, her spirit unbroken. In 2008, Del and Phyllis finally married a victory that came just months before Dell passed away. 40. Mabel Hampton. A dancer, storyteller, and a proud voice for the LGBTQ community, Mabel Hampton's love for Lillian Foster spanned 46 years, a testament to the depth of her heart. Mabel fought for LGBTQ rights, never backing down. As she grew older, respiratory illnesses slowly took her strength, and she passed in 1989. Her legacy lives on, her courage and love still celebrated by those who fight for the community she cherished. 41. Chavela Vargas. Known as the voice of Mexico, Chavela Vargas poured her heart into every song, singing of love, loss, and longing with a passion that could not be ignored. Living openly as a lesbian in a deeply conservative society, she broke barriers, her voice a force that refused to be silenced. Later in life, heart problems began to weaken her, but Chavela kept singing until the very end. She died in 2012, leaving behind songs that still echo the raw truth of the human heart. 42. Ellen Gate Starr, co-founder of Hull House, Ellen Gate Starr dedicated her life to helping others. Her partnership with Jane Addams was more than just professional, it was a profound bond that fueled their shared dream of social justice. As the years passed, Ellen's heart began to fail her, the disease slowly taking its toll. She passed in 1940, her contributions to workers' rights and social reform still inspiring those who fight for justice. 43. Violette Leduc. Violette Leduc dared to write about the things no one else would. 
Her novels, like The Bastard and Therese and Isabel, explored female desire and loneliness, challenging society's rules. Her deep relationships with women, particularly Simone de Beauvoir, were the fuel for her creativity. In her later years, asthma and severe respiratory issues often left her bedridden, her health failing. Violette died in 1972, 44. Storm de la Verie. A name synonymous with courage, Stormy de Larvery was known for her role in the Stonewall Riots, protecting her community by patrolling the streets of New York. She lived as a butch lesbian, in a time when such an identity was dangerous, but she never wavered. Dementia clouded her mind in her later years, a cruel fate for someone so sharp and strong. Stormy passed in 2014, her bravery still a beacon for those who continue her fight. 45. Dora Stevens. A key figure in the fight for women's rights, Dora Stevens worked with the National Woman's Party, paving the way for change. She also cherished deep connections with women that shaped her life. Kidney disease took hold of her in her later years, but even as her body grew weak, she continued to fight for equality. Doris passed in 1963. 46. Natalie Clifford Barney. Known as the Queen of Literary Salons, Natalie Clifford Barney brought together the most brilliant LGBTQ plus minds of her time. Natalie loved women openly, her passion a driving force in her life and work. But age and illness caught up with her, her once vibrant energy fading as heart problems weakened her. She died quietly in 1972. 47. Barbara Jordan. A force in American politics, Barbara Jordan's voice commanded attention and respect. She shared her life with Nancy Earle, though the world knew little of it. Multiple sclerosis began to take its toll, leaving Barbara weaker, her body failing even as her mind remained sharp. She continued to speak out, her powerful words refusing to be silenced until her death in 1996. Her life was a testament to strength in the face of adversity. 48. Bessie Smith, the Empress of the Blues, Bessie Smith sang of pain and love with a voice that shook the world. Her relationships with women were a part of her life, never hidden, but never flaunted. A car accident in 1937 left her critically injured, and reports suggest she was denied medical care because of her race. She died soon after, her voice forever echoing the struggles and joys of life. 49. Miriam Van Waters a prison reform advocate, Miriam Van Waters changed the lives of countless incarcerated women. She shared a deep connection with Geraldine Thompson, whose love supported her through the challenges she faced. Cancer came into her life in her later years, slowly taking her strength. She passed in 1974, her efforts leaving a lasting impact on the criminal justice system. 50. Sarah Teasdale a poet whose work spoke of love's beauty and sorrow, Sarah Teasdale found inspiration in her relationships with women, her words filled with the depth of her feelings. But her health was frail and depression weighed heavily on her heart. Pneumonia eventually claimed her life in 1933, her poems still a haunting reminder of the delicate balance between love and pain.